Instagram. Well, I was gonna say October. It is not October. Brian, Billy, Brian, Billy, same thing. <laughs> And today I am here with my most anticipated November reads for 2017. I have a total of six this time and as always I tried to pick ones that aren't super duper popular so hopefully you guys find something that's not on the typical radar. There is one that is a little bit popular, okay a lot popular, but is by one of my favorite authors so like I have to mention it. So without further ado, let us get started. So to get the most popular one out of the way right away, I will start with it and it is Renegades by Marissa Meyer. This is supposed to come out on November 7th, 2017 and it follows the Renegades who are humans that have extraordinary abilities. The renegades work as champions of justice against the villains that they overthrew many years ago and one of the villains named Nova wants revenge against the renegades. She then meets a renegade named Adrian and everything changes. That's all I really know about it. I'm assuming it's just like heroes versus villains but like Marissa Meyer so like need in my life you know. The next book I have I'm actually super excited for because I ended up getting an advanced readers copy of it. It is Bonfire by Kristen Ryder. This is also supposed to come out on November 7th and it follows Abby Williams who left her hometown many years ago to become an environmentalist lawyer in Chicago. She ends up taking a case in her hometown and she begins to find some strange connections between her case and a scandal that occurred involving her friend Casey before she disappeared many years ago. So as Abby tries to uncover what actually happened in this case and why these weird connections are happening. She discovers a ritual called the game and that's all the back of the book really says so I'm intrigued to see what it's about. It seems like it could be super cool and also like the author plays Jessica Jones so like I'm down for it. The next book I have is called Fragments of the Lost and this is by Megan Miranda and it is supposed to come out November 14th, 2017. The book follows Jessa whose boyfriend died in a terrible accident and his mother asks her to pack up all of his belongings for her because she just can't bring herself to do it. So as Jessa is packing up all his things, she starts to uncover things about her relationship she didn't exactly realize and she begins to realize that she may not have known Caleb as well as she thought she did. Again, I think that this could take a whole bunch of different directions so I'm intrigued to see where it goes. It says it's a thriller so you know your girl loves herself some thrillers so I'm excited for this one just to see where it goes. The next one I have is called The Missing by C.L. Taylor and this is supposed to come out on November 7th as well and the little blurb said that it's for fans of Reconstructing Amelia which is one of my favorite adult thrillers so I am a pretty much looking forward to it just because of that. And it also says that it's an unreliable narrator, which I love, so excited for that as well. It is about a 15 year old boy named Billy who just went missing and his mom has to start uncovering a lot of secrets that her family is keeping in order to find her son. So, again, one of those books that could be super interesting depending on what way it takes, so I'm intrigued by that and also Reconstructing Amelia, so like, need it in my life. The next book I have is called The House and it is by Simon Lelick and it is supposed to come out on November 2nd, 2017 and it follows Jack and Sid who just bought their dream house and then they discover something in the attic but they choose to ignore it which turns out to be a huge mistake because somebody was just murdered outside of their house and now the police are watching them. So again, another one that could be super entertaining depending on what way it takes. So excited for that one as well. And then my final book, honestly I'm only excited because of who the author is. It's called Girl Logic and it is by Eliza Schelzinger who is a female comedian and I absolutely adore her. She is so so funny. If you haven't watched any of her stand-up, a lot of it is on Netflix so you can check her out there. This is supposed to come out on November 7th as well. It's basically a collection of essays all about like feminism and what it's like to be a woman and singlehood and relationships and sex and she's just a really funny person in my opinion so I'm excited just because of who the author is because if it's anything like her stand-up then I think it's gonna be hilarious. Alright guys so those are my most anticipated reads for November 2017. Let me know what books you guys are excited for as well as if you're excited for any of these and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!